In today's video, we are going to continue the classification of lipids and the subtopics that we are going to cover here is the introduction of those classification, what are those classification, their example and then there is a teeny tiny quiz waiting for you guys. So let's start. As we are already done with the triglyceride, now we are left with vexes, with terpenes, and with another type of lipids that is the phospholipids. So and this is just a, a quick overview of the last uh, classification that we have done. Now we will do uh, the vexes. So vexes are basically the esters of saturated fatty acid and long chain alcohol like agar aap yahan niche dekhoge to yahan pe dekhen kitni long chain of alcohols hain and they are the esters of the saturated fatty acid they are widespread as a protective coating on the leaves or on any fruit right so these are widespread as the protective coatings on fruits and leaf some insects also secrete wax like this particular insect here it secrete a certain form of wax right chemically jo ye hote hain they are a long chain of alkanes as you can see in all these examples these are the long chain of uh, alkanes with odd number of carbon hamesha odd number honge like from c25 to c35 we can see that and alcohols ketones and esters of long chain fatty acids ye uh, jo hote hain ye plant ko protect karte hain from water loss taaki water loss na ho theek hai uske alawa and depressive damage unhe koi damage bhi na ho iske alawa ye water barrier provide karte hain to certain insects aur unke alawa kuch sheep ko aur birds ko matlab ye animals ko bhi barrier water barrier provide karte hain aur ye plants ko protect karte hain ki unme water loss na ho aur wo damage na ho so these are some of the properties of the waxes that is a certain type of lipid now phospholipids so jo phospholipids hain they are the derivatives of phosphatidic acid theek hai they are composed of glycerol as you can see here they are composed of glycerol they are composed of fatty acid and phosphoric acid right so these are composed of these things nitrogenous bases such as choline or serine are important components of phospholipids theek hai ye agar aap dekho to inka bhi hydrophobic uh, hydrophobic inki tails hoti hain aur hydrophilic inka head hota hai ye ek common structure hai phospholipids ka uske baad agar hum yahan pe dekhein तो जो फोस्फोटायरिक एसिड है ये कंपोज हुआ हुआ होता है ऑफ ग्लिसरोल अगर हम यहाँ पे देखें तो ये है फोस्फोटायरिक एसिड ये बेसिकली किससे कंपोज हुआ हुआ है इसमें देखें ग्लिसरोल है इसमें फैटी एसिड है ठीक है ऑन सी वन एंड सी टू राइट हेयर एंड हेयर राइट सो इट इज कम्पोज ऑफ दिस ठीक है और नाइट्रोजेनिस बेसिस सच एज कॉलिन ठीक है इट इज ऑल्सो अटैच टू दी फॉस्फोरिक एसिड इन दी फॉस्फेटायरिक एसिड राइट नाउ टर्पेनॉइड्स टर्पेनॉइड्स आर बेसिकली अ वेरी लार्ज एंड इंपॉर्टेंट ग्रुप ऑफ कंपाउंड्स विच आर मेर अप ऑफ सिंपल रिपीटिंग यूनिट दे आर मेर अप ऑफ सिंपल repeating isoprenoid units theek hai ye ek common structure hai of terpenoid ka it is the common structure of terpenoids theek hai ab aap dekhen to jo terpenoids hote hain um, they can exist uh, they give rise to some other compound as well such as rubber right एंड सच एज टेट्रा पेन होते हैं ठीक है पेर डायटर पेन होते हैं मोनोटर पेन होते हैं ये उनके एग्जाम्पल्स हैं और कुछ उनके स्ट्रक्चर्स हैं 
squalene it is used in some of these skin product as well it's a very nice uh, terpene oil a certain form of uh, fatty acid and lipid now there is the quiz time the protective the first mcq for today protective coating on fruits and leaves kya hoti hai kon protective protective coating provide karta hai fruits aur leaves ke surface pe are the waxes terpenoids or liquid liquid waise option nikal jayega jo terpenoids hote hain ye isoprenoid unit se bane hue hote hain but they don't uh, act as a protective coating on fruits and leaves so the option that is correct here is this waxes then the second one is that terpenes are made up of isoprenoid unit glycogen or carbon as we have just learned that terpenes are made up of isoprenoid units so this one is the correct so this mark the end of our lesson if you guys got any question ask them below and i'll get back to you as soon as possible thank you so much for watching